Pop did tell us before the game we might see some zone. Here is Zion stepping back, pulling the trigger, and hitting a three! Good looking shot, stepped in with confidence. The Spurs are going to give him that look. He's got to be aggressive and take it. Did it against the zone and got them within five, and then they give up a basket on the other end to DeRozan. Here's a lob to Zion, and he finishes over DeRozan. Five straight for the rookie. This is about the time in each of the previous three quarters where they have taken Zion out of the game. We'll see if they let him play. I don't want Alvin Gentry to sit back down where someone can tell him that no, he has to come out. Here's White. Comes back and drills a three-pointer to put the fans back in their seats. I think Nico Melli is coming in for him right here. Here's Zion for three. Hit it again. If I'm Zion Williamson, I'm looking over at the bench and saying, leave me in. And Nico Melli is going back to sit down. <laughs> he did. He was at the scorer's table. They just pulled him. Zion's got eight points in the last minute. Defends there. Gets the loose ball. They want Zion to get it. Here he is. And Pirtle blocked it. Zion gets it back and finishes. Ten points in just over a minute for Zion Williamson. By far his best stretch of the night. And his team is within three. Nice move by White with That's the blow a by. Beautiful hesitation by Derek White. Zion gives it up. Gets it back. Here he is again. Got it again! And Alvin Gentry over at the bench frustrated because he's about to set a substitution in and Zion hits another basket. And he's looking for orders. He's not looking to make a decision. He's looking for somebody else to tell him what the decision is. Foul. Foul on ball against Derek White. Well, this guy has this in his game. It's going to be a problem moving forward. The ability to stretch the defense, we already know his athleticism. Now he goes up and gets the basketball, and then another wide open three. 13 points in about 90 seconds. Three of three from three point land. So right now he's got 18 points and seven of 10 shooting. But I also don't think it's. I, I don't think we should be surprised that he gets more of a chance to have a rhythm by playing a longer stretch of time. Here's Zion against Aldridge. Gets it back. Zion for four for four! Welcome to the NBA! And Alvin Gentry sends another center back. Derek <laughs> Favors is going, oh no, now he's coming back. How will this crowd respond once he exits the ball game? It's an image for good. Bellinelli answers and gives the Spurs the lead back. Zion has 21 on 8 of 11, 4 of 4 from 3, 7 rebounds, 3 assists, and 18 minutes. Pick and roll. Williamson attacks, and he's fouled. He's not coming out now. The funny thing is Alvin Gentry wanted them to bring the ball up and, the call, court, a and call a timeout. <laughs> he Lonzo, didn't really want it. <laughs> Lonzo Ball audible. I like it. Ball knows what the people want. They want more Zion. No, it's not the people. They want to win the game. Guy's on a special roll. Aldridge picks up his third foul. Zion is one for two at the line tonight. Four for four from three-point land, though. I'd like to take a look at the analytics that says if he plays five more minutes, he can get hurt. There's no... I don't even want to get into it. What a performance by this young player. He's got to be proud. And he's, his New Orleans fan base has got to be ecstatic. 17 points in the second half. 22 for the game. DeJounte Murray with a nice finish on the baseline. San Antonio by three. 
An important game for both these teams, battling with Memphis and a couple other squads, Phoenix and Portland, and try to get into that eighth spot in the West. Here's a timeout by New Orleans.